There are so many reasons why this new MSc course is unique. And the primary focus, of course, is to prepare to develop candidates, graduates for leadership, specifically within the IT, within the science disciplines. SIT, and this is the important thing I want you to take away today. SIT helps you to become a leader and to create a team of leaders as well. Now, one element of this course I know is going to appeal to our next speaker is the thesis. The thesis can be written on the student's experience in their own startup business. Now, what you have is you've got access to the SIT tech park, to investors, or you can choose to use one of SIT's own business network partners, such as Acronis, Citrix, Microsoft, McKinsey and Company, as well as in the SIT leading research laboratories as well. I can't stress enough, this level of engagement with business is extremely rare in a highly technical master's degree from other prestigious specialist universities. Now, I want to get on to our next speaker. This is an incredible story. He's a perfect example of the types of people you're going to have access to and be influenced by at SIT and this wonderful new MSc. He's a software engineer. He's a system developer. He's got invaluable first-hand experience of what it takes to grow and ultimately sell a business. His talk today is from software engineering to a 600 and $70 million business, that's one big reason to join SIT. It gives me enormous pleasure to welcome Igor C. Soyev. He's senior architect, Nginx business unit, F5 Networks. He's co-founder of Nginx as well. And as if that wasn't enough, he's the original author of Nginx Server. Igor, I'm gonna hand it over to you. Thank you, Mark. Um, I studied in Bauman Moscow State Technical University and in 1994 I graduated with an engineer degree. Uh, 90s was a hard time in Russia for engineers and I started to work as system administrator in a small trading company. Uh, the company changed names three times, so it doesn't matter to mention it. And uh, I worked with Microsoft DOS, Windows, uh, Novel Network, and FreeBSD Unix. Uh, and as my job duties, I implemented an um, automated uh, information system on uh, using uh, web technologies. And I so like this technology. So in 2000, uh, 2000 I decided to leave uh, the company. Uh, nevertheless, the uh, internet bubble burst. And I started to work in a rounder as system administrator. Uh, at the time, I started to, to develop Nginx web server as a hobby project. So uh, I developed it about uh, three years and in 2004, uh, I publicly released it uh, for everyone on the BSD license. Uh, the popularity of Nginx grew and um, It, uh, so I will uh, describe shortly what is Nginx uh, itself. Nginx is uh, a web server and proxy server that uh, sit be between uh, your web applications and clients. Um, it can effect effectively um, handle uh, simultaneous uh, tens of thousands of simultaneous connections. So Applications can offload uh, the task to deliver content to slow clients to Nginx. And they can focus only 
on the task produce this content. So in general, it can be called like uh, content delivery, uh, con application content delivery. So popularity of Nginx grew at, at uh, 2011, uh, almost half of most visited sites in Russia used Nginx and about 7% <coughs> of most visited sites in the world uh, use Nginx. So uh, for all this, um, uh, I'm, I'm engineer. I have no business, any business skills. I'm not entrepreneur by behavior. So for all these years, uh, almost 10 years, I didn't think that uh, I can run business uh, around, based on Nginx. Um, uh, however, in 2011, I decided to start the business based on Nginx and uh, I and, uh, and I founded uh, the company with two co-founders. Uh, it was Maxim Konovalov and Andrew Alexeev. We raised several venture capitals from uh, we, we, raised, uh, we raised several rounds of venture capital from different venture funds and uh, the last one was from was led by Goldman Sachs in 19 in uh, 2018. In 2013, we uh, we hired our beautiful uh, CEO, Gus Robertson. And after this, our company uh, became a real multi, um, a real international company with several offices, uh, headquarters in uh, San Francisco, office in Moscow, in Ireland, in Singapore, and uh, in Tokyo. And eventually, the company was acquired by F5 Networks in the in the previous year for 600. Seventy million dollars, and now I'm a senior architect in in the next business unit in F Five Networks. So, what uh, it was a technical part of <clears throat> uh, of my career, and uh, now I would like to focus um, more on business part. As I said, I'm not a businessman. So uh, three person on, on the left side of, this, uh, of the slide really run the company. Maxim, Andrew, and Gus. So uh, <clears throat> without these guys, I was not able to, to found the company because I cannot manage people. I can do marketing. I uh, cannot sell products. So all what I did, I upload all these tasks to this person, these guys. And uh, and what I would want to say that uh, SAT give you a unique chance to uh, to combine your education. You can get not only technical skills, but also uh, entrepreneur skills you will understand how how the business works uh, how it's uh, important to understand all the business and uh, and i i hope that will allow you to run your own very successful business thank you